Welcome to the end of the world. JK, this is the Ordovician Solarian extinction, which occurred 440 million years ago. Many forms of life lived in shallow and deep waters with their different niches, and land was near the South Pole. See that land down there? That's volcanic rock. They were worn down by wind and water. The erosion of rocks absorbs CO2 from the atmosphere, causing low levels of carbon dioxide and cause the temperatures to drop dramatically. Because the temperatures drop, ocean levels decreased and water froze. Glaciers were constantly growing and shrinking. Due to the lower water levels caused by the increasing size of the glaciers, shallow water organisms began to die off. More on that death, organisms also died because the water temperature was freezing. Now for some statistics! Bang! 86% of marine life dead! Those dead creatures now include trilobites, bivalves, brachiopods, bryozoans, echinoderms, arthropods, and nautiloids. The winners of this game of life were the planktonic graptolites and the conodonts. Now because these two survived, they caused the creation of a whole new generation, the jawed and bony fish. Now let's pretend this were to happen today. How are we survived? That's a great question. We would live through this event by seeking warm areas and creating indoor farms, since the temperature would be too cold for plants to grow and produce oxygen. In order to protect the animals, we would need to build special sanctuaries for them to live. Because of this, we wouldn't be able to enjoy the great outdoors, not that we would anyway, and our food supply would diminish. Most life would freeze and die if they don't seek warmth. Well, that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching.